Yes, Cherie and Mike, let's take a look right now, a live look at all the cars heading southbound on 71 right now, approaching the Lytle Tunnel. Not only are all those drivers you see navigating traffic, but they're also trying to avoid pavement that is anything but perfect. On most interstates, you don't see or hear this. Motorcycles catching air and semis that sound like they're about to lose their load. I don't understand why they won't fix them. Scott Mays and his plumbing crew spent a lot of time driving on I-71 through Cincinnati. When he heads south, this is what Scott sees right before he goes into the Lytle Tunnel, two lanes of chunky, uneven asphalt. I kind of dread getting on, you know, and I'm like, oh, I wonder what it's going to be like today. Most drivers will tell you a short stretch of the right lane has been a mess for months. But now that orange barrels line the third street exit, what's normally the fast lane on 71 South is also chock full of cracked pavement. Ohio's Department of Transportation has reduced the speed limit from 55 to 45, but there are no signs telling drivers just how rough the road really is. It's going to take something major to, you know, to get that fixed. An ODOT official says a major repair is on the way. The stretch of 71 in such bad shape is actually part of a bridge. This summer, the bridge's deck, which supports the highway, will be replaced. UC engineering professor Rich Miller says that when a bridge deck starts showing its age, the pavement above the surface often follows suit. There just are times when the concrete, due to salt, due to traffic, due to weather, um, freezing and thawing, the thing will just wear out and you just have to replace it. The replacement project won't be done until this fall, so drivers take note, slow down, and brace yourself for a bumpy ride. Yeah, traveling at 45 miles per hour, it takes about 15 seconds to drive through the stretch of I-71 that's been crumbling. You know, that really doesn't sound like a whole lot of time until you're surrounded by a number of other drivers, all of whom are trying to outmaneuver all those cracks in the road. Reporting live, Todd Dykes, WWT News 5. All right, Todd, thank you. And as Todd was saying right there, the Ohio Department of Transportation will be replacing the southbound bridge deck along 71 just before the Lytle Tunnel this summer. Next year, crews will then switch sides and replace the bridge deck on the northbound side of the highway there.